Hello everybody, welcome back to your channel Echo Engineering. In this video, we are diving into a discussion between algorithmic trading and quantitative trading and we try to find out what are the differences between these two types of trading. While algorithmic trading has always been our main focus in this channel, uh, quantitative trading has recently emerged as a hot topic in the trading world in the past decades. Uh, however, I've noticed that many new traders find this concept somewhat ambiguous and struggle to differentiate between them. That's why I've decided to discuss briefly on this topic in this video. Let's start with the first difference between algorithmic trading and quantitative trading. In quantitative trading, primary goal is to construct a diversified portfolio comprising various assets such as stocks, cryptocurrencies, and forex pairs. Uh, on the other hand, algorithmic trading tends to focus more on individual assets, although there are always some exceptions where multiple assets may be traded simultaneously with algorithmic trading. However, the emphasis is typically, typically lies in executing strategies on a single pair or share rather than managing a broad portfolio. Moving on the second difference, algorithmic trading relies heavily on predefined algorithm and logic to execute trades based on indicators like RSI or moving averages. In quantitative trading, however, there is the option to incorporate machine learning models. These models analyze various labels alongside market data to make trading decisions and manage portfolio dynamically. Essentially, while algorithmic trading follows present rules, quantitative trading leverage AI to adapt and optimize trading strategies over time. Although it may seem a little confusing, the mathematics difficulties behind these models have already been addressed and implemented in different Python libraries, including TensorFlow, Scikit-Learn, or PyTorch. And we can leverage these libraries to implement and train our AI models. It's like uh, to driving a car. You don't need to know how a car is built from scratch to drive it. You just need to learn how to operate it. Similarly, our focus in the upcoming videos is on utilizing these libraries effectively to enhance our trading strategies. Of course, after working with them for a long time, you will learn even the math behind it as well. The third disparity lies in the time horizon of trades. While both quantitative and algorithmic trading can accommodate high frequency trading, quantitative trading generally involves less frequent trades compared to algorithmic trading. Quantitative trading strategies are often geared toward intraday or swing trading as well as long-term investing, resulting in fewer trades executed over time. In contrast, algorithmic trading tends to involve more frequent trades, sometimes on even daily basis. And Last but not least, uh, the fourth difference, I believe, lies in the objectives of profitability. In algorithmic trading, the primary aim is to generate profit while minimizing losses. We just want to be profitable. In contrast, in quantitative trading, aim to outperform a benchmark, such as, for example, S&P 500 or NASDAQ. For instance, if the benchmark or for the, the S&P 500 gains 100% in a year and our strategy only yields a 75% profit, it is considered unsuccessful strategy because we could have achieved even better returns by simply investing in the benchmark or buying the NASDAQ index or, or S&P 500 index. Uh, we assess this performance comparison using various metrics, including alpha unit derived from linear regression analysis. This is a probability or a mathematics uh, concept, the linear regression, and we will explain it completely in upcoming videos when we want to have a clean comparison between the strategy and the benchmark and how we can outperform the benchmark. Now it is your turn. Uh, what differences do you see between quantitative trading and algorithmic trading? Please leave me your thoughts in the comments. It's very valuable for us because in the upcoming videos, we are going to go deeply inside 
implementing and training an AI model for doing quantitative trading. I wish you have a good day. Goodbye.